a Twitch stream. I do not know what happened. I somehow lost connection. I do not know why. I have everything hardwired in. But I'm back, and I should stay back, at least for right now. And according to the computer behind me, I am back. So, unfortunately, I cannot um, do the, all of the ore that I have, but at least I can make the item that I wanted to make. So we're going to go to Flint and Steel, so we can actually start the darn portal. So we have all of the items, I believe, that we need. I'm going to be really, really upset if I missed one. But, hey, that's part of what uh, experimentation is about, right? So this is um, the first time in a while that I've built a portal, so if I mess up, please don't be too mad. But uh, anyway, though, uh, let's get started. Hello everyone, this is KL Tech Nerd. I am going to start building my uh, first uh, gate in this world. Uh, I'm thinking about putting it right here. I think it's a nice corner. And what I'm probably going to do is make like a stage right here and everything. Uh, and then have it up on top of it. So it should be pretty out of the way. It shouldn't be that far though, so I can easily go to the... Um, whatever it's called. I keep forgetting. But... Uh, yeah, and it should be nice and easy to get to and everything, and then it shouldn't get in the way of any of my builds or anything either. So, um, let's get started building it. Here I'm building it, and I don't even know what it's called. So, what I'm going to do first, because I have my wheat f farm over here, is I'm just kind of clearing out some of this th stuff. That way I can make sure that there's no uh, items in the way. So I don't um, make it kind of lopsided or anything. Watch me make it lopsided anyway. But So what I'm going to do is first I'm going to lay down, if I can remember this correctly, I hope I do, two of these. One cobblestone on each side. One of these. Two more of these. One cobblestone. Some more obsidian. Ow. One, two, three. And then a cobblestone right here. And let's just light this thing and make sure that it even works. Before we start building anything else, let's make sure that it works. And it works! Awesome! I might go through right now. And, oh yeah, it's called the nether. Okay, I did have it correct. So, this is KL Tech Nerd, and we're going to go into the nether very, very shortly. But what I wanted to do, too, was, and now I'm going to have to go take a nap, darn it, is I wanted to uh, build a nether portal so we can make it to the nether, get some nether stuff, and hightail it back out here. But also because we're going to be uh, building a lot of nether portals so we can build a gold farm later. And also with... Uh, the um, nether portal is a um, the ability to kill zombie pigment and sometimes they drop nuggets and everything so that's all good come on sleep sleep good and I'm so excited I finally got the achievement for into the nether on the uh, Xbox which is why you do this in uh, which is why you do this in the um, survival. Because when you do it in survival, you could actually get some achievements from it, which is kind of cool. And who doesn't like achievements? I might eventually, I might tear down the portal though and move it. Because I kind of wanted to um, have the uh, gold farm running a lot more than just, hey, it's in the corner doing stuff. I kind of wanted to have it closer, so I'm not really sure about its location. But, hey, this will work for right now for what we want to do. So we're going to go and do this.
And, you know, I can't resist going into the nether right now. I just, there's too many items and good stuff, so let's do it very, very shortly. <laughs> So let me see here. We're going to put some of this stuff here. And let me see if I get this right. I probably should put up, put these items away first, though, before I actually walk into it as people are screaming into their computers. Just go already! I know, I know. I'll do it in a minute. So, let me just drop off some items and then I'll go into the nether for a few seconds at least and get some uh, supplies. Kind of exciting. It's my first time in this world being into the nether, so I don't know what it's going to be like. I've been into the nether in other games, but not this one, so it's all exciting. It's all Oh, I had wood right here. That's where all my wood went. So I didn't even need to cut down those trees, those poor trees. Put all my diamond stuff away. Carry some cobblestone. Definitely get rid of the iron. Definitely get rid of the obsidian. Maybe the food. Don't know though, I kind of want to have a snack, something to eat. So... Actually, I probably should get another stone pickaxe, too, because this one's getting ready to die on me. Do I already have one? I don't want to use my, up my diamond one, though. Okay, so let's go over here. Craft another one very, very quickly. Which, of course, for me means it'll take 30 years. Craft a couple of... You know, I'll take the wood with me. You don't know when you're going to need some wood. I probably am not going to build much with it, though, just because it, um, it will, uh, catch on fire in the nether so, so easily. I mean, that stuff is just horrible at catching fire. I mean, really. So, <clears throat> the mission, if I choose to accept it, is to go into the nether and get some really, really quick supplies. Hopefully... I'll make it back. So, without any other ado, drum roll please. Da -da 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 -da. Let's go. First time in this world. Entering the nether and whoa. That is that looks like one heck of a drop off. Come on. Oh. Okay. Are you serious? Oh, man. Really? Oh, man. I can't even see anything in here right now. Wow. I apologize for how dark it is. Are you serious? Just... Yeah, go through... Oh! I could have come out on this side. That is cool. Come on, da, 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 da. let's get out of here. Let's get out of this po popsicle stand. Anyway, I apologize for that. I probably really should have thought about that better. Can't even see anything in there right now. Uh, torches. I probably should have gotten torches. I completely botched that. I apologize. So... You know, I'll take you. And you. And you. Oh, I already had three obsidian. That's just plain sad. Okay, fine. So let's go over here. Uh, leave that there for right now. And now, let's 
go over here, put you up there. Put you in there, and then hopefully get some charcoal. Okay. Done yet? No. That's fine. That's fine. Just take your time. I feel like I'm going through the Stargate for the first time. Okay, so supplies. I forgot torches, yes. Okay, fine. Oh wow, I got 11 of them now. I better be good. Whoa. So... I don't know though. See, part of my problem with the gold farm is that if I leave it open to the air, zombie pigmen are going to pop out of it, which I kind of want, because I'd love to kill them and get some res. But at the same exact time, I would really, really, really like not to die. But I really, really, really would kind of like the items. So, <clears throat> okay, let's pretend like this is my first time. My mission, if I choose to accept it, is to go where many gamers have gone before. This is K.L. Technard, bringing you my captain's log for my trip into the nether for the first time. Wink, wink, in this world. Hopefully, I, do, I make it back okay. Thank you all for watching. Pop out on this side. And then, okay. Did I actually spawn in another fortress? I might have actually spawned in a freaking nether fortress. I can see a bridge over there. With a... Is that a spawner? I wish I had binoculars in this game. That'd be cool. Soul sand. Okay. Let's go down here for a minute. So, okay, so far so good. I'm not dead yet. That's an improvement. Let's save three torches for later. So then I... So let's go over here. Okay. Switch to this guy. Get some of this stuff. Oh, well, this stuff breaks easy. Okay. surprised I'm kind of out in the open. I'm surprised that nothing's attacked me yet. Hopefully I'm not speaking too soon. So let's just collect a bunch of this stuff. And... Man, I do not know why I have such luck as to always spawn into, like, the best places to spawn. I have n never really spawned in, like, some place where I'm going, Oh gosh, I just fell into a, uh, ooh, nether wart. Thank you. Just 
take some of this. I've never spawned, like, right over a lava pit and then fallen in and been like, No, I died! The horror! I'm always like, Oh! There I go. I died. No, I didn't. <sighs> Light. There we go. Okay. I can get you. I get you. Right now I'm going to stay close to the portal until I can get my bearings around in here. Okay, those guys are bad news. They are really heavy hitters. I would know. I've uh, farmed them before. Okay, we got... <sighs> More of this... Man, this place is awesome. So should I call it quits? I don't know. Let's just really, really quickly. So I have a nether wart. I thought I could grow those. I hope I didn't just destroy my only one. Nether brick. That's kind of cool. Soul sand. Nether rack. Okay, so let me see here. I'm going to hold on to that so I don't hopefully lose track of it is my only nether wart. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Okay. I'm leaving. I got it. Okay. Let's get out of here. I'm good. I don't want to lose my bounty for the day. Okay, come on. Leave, 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 leave. Phew! Leaving the nether. And I survived my vi- Oh, no. That's not good. Run, run. I didn't know it had turned nighttime. No. Run. I don't want to get eaten by a zombie or blown up by a creeper. Probably really should finish this ha uh, castle thing, too. Why did I decide to go into the nether when I need to build a castle? Of course. I probably really should have worked on that first. So, now that I just made it daytime, hopefully everybody will burn to death. Uh, what the? Ah, spider! Why did it have to be spiders? The problem with the spiders is that they keep you from moving. Moving is what stops you from, like, getting blown up by a creeper. So, <laughs> kind of is important to not, uh, let the, um, spiders slow you down. If you know what I'm saying. Go over here. And I'm actually fairly surprised that I didn't die yet from uh, dealing with these guys. Because I thought I, 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 th I thought for sure I'd die on my first trip into the nether. And I didn't, so that's kind of cool. Anyway, though, what I'll probably definitely do, and this is just me being a pre-planner because that's what I do, is I'm actually thinking about building like four towers. Uh, in this area. Well, not four tower towers, but four different uh, farms. I'm thinking one iron golem farm in this area, one mob farm, which would be kind of cool, and then one um, iron farm. Uh, hold on for a second.
Anyway, probably what I'll end up doing is putting a mob farm here, another mob farm. I don't know about the another mob farm, though, because I don't know if it'll actually make a benefit or if just making this one taller will be a bigger benefit. But I'm probably going to definitely make this taller, build a iron farm, and then build a uh, gold farm. Just so then that way, like, if I'm in this little house thing, like all three farms, uh, three, all three or four farms are running. So then I'm just kind of like sitting there going, oh yeah, I'm completely awesome and I'm just sitting in so much resources. Yay. So that's my idea. And I actually made it into the nether for the first time, which is in this game, which is cool. And I wasn't necessarily going to be, um, do too much else. Uh, especially if I end up moving the portal, because that'll be a pain to move the portal if I, um, uh, do too much in that area. But then again, though, too, I don't exactly want zombie pigmen going all over the area. So I guess it's really a trade-off. Sorry about the long trek. Anyway, though, probably what I'm going to be doing, though, because I don't want zombie pigmen exactly spilling out and to this world and everything, is I'll probably end up going and then building a platform like this. And then I will probably end up putting, like, a wall around it. So, like, let's say this is three, four out. Four is good. Four is good. I like four. So, then I go and then build, a, like, a wall right here. Eventually, the wall probably is going to be, like, three blocks high. One, two, three, four. And I got more than enough cobblestone to be able to finish this, so that's cool. Two, three, that would be four. So maybe do something like this, so there will be like a... Nice staircase leading up to it. I don't know, though. I might flip that around. Just because it would be so annoying to, um... Always go through it and then nearly fall to my death. I mean, I'm just saying. That would be kind of a bummer. So... Gotta make sure that this is even. Okay, cool. Yeah, it is even. And the reason why it's too high is because then that way nobody can um, jump over the cobblestone. And so, yeah. I do not know what it is, though, with my luck with spawning inside structures in the nether. I really, really don't. Because another world that I have, too, I built a portal, and the first place that I spawn into is the nether castle thing. 
What am I doing? So let's see here. Don't tell me I put it. I left it way over there. Ah, oh, darn it. See, the main problem with me putting a gold farm in this area, I kind of like the idea because then the pigmen will just spawn. But to the same exact extent, I really, really don't want to put it so close that I just get an overwhelming number of pigmen. So when I finally do decide to empty it, there's 50 different pigmen to kill, and then they're killing me, and... Ah, uh, good times, I guess, right? And then I'll probably eventually clean up this area or do something with it or something. I don't know. I just jumped over that like a boss. So now let's go over here and then we just go. And then the whole idea with this is then this way I can um, block off these zombie pigments so they don't enter my um, area and then they don't like start becoming a nuisance. They're just kind of stuck. Which is what I would want. So, really, really fast. Let me just go. And don't tell me it's getting nighttime already. I feel like it was just nighttime. Oh, come on. Oh, this isn't even the prettiest thing I've ever done. But is it functional? Yep. Run off to bed, that way I can sleep off the night. And I did mean for this episode to be shorter. However, it really didn't turn out to be shorter, so what do I do, right? Oh, well, at least I shouldn't get the message telling me that it's daytime. Oh, yeah, I did get the message still. That's funny. Probably definitely going to log off, though, the minute that I can build some sort of a wall around the uh, nether portal. Because I really don't want to have zombie pigment everywhere. And then I can beautify it or do anything else later. And that, I really need to make it look more beautiful, but other than that, I mean, it's pretty nice right now, so... I still need to also find some slimes so I can make some sticky pistons, so I can make some doors, so I can... Ah, uh, so much to do. Uh, I cut back on this so it looks a little nicer, and then do 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 do. Oh, 
I'm not even getting any injury from this. I love it. And basically this will just be a nice little area where I can uh, access the portal from and then the walls should protect it so no zombie pigmen can get out. Then again, the two I don't really know if any would spawn right here because of the uh, having the stone so close up to it, but oh well, right? I might also create some sort of a system where I can uh, use it to get out there, uh, to get in there easier. For right now, though, I mean, it's really looking nice, at least in the way that a weird brick rock sculpture would. But... Oh! Darn it. Uh, get rid of this, get rid of this. Nice. So now I have like a little walkway with a little archway. And what I'm thinking I might do is... Something like this. Oh, that looks kind of cool. I like that. Okay, and then... For right now, at least, I'm just going to go... Get some of these. Okay, I do have some dirt. Okay. Did not know I had some dirt. this stuff. I don't want to use up the nether, nether rack. That stuff's hard to get to. But I can do this. And then that way nobody can come out and attack me and it's blocked off a little bit. So that's kind of the idea for now. Uh, I'm going to leave it running. Uh, I'm not going to take down the portal or anything, no matter how tempting that is. One reason, too, being because last thing that I need to do is take it down and then put it back up and then take it down and then put it back up. Uh, I almost would be would rather be surprised. Maybe I'll hear a zombie pigman come out and then I can come around, uh, use a bow to archer him, and then uh, get some gold nuggets, which would be cool. So, alas, that's pretty much where I'm going for now. So, I'm going to call it quits right now. Um... Yeah, it's been a little over an hour. I didn't mean for it to be this long. Uh, have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please subscribe if you uh, haven't, and uh, it really, really helps me out. And feel free to like any of the videos that you do indeed like. Uh, tell me in the comments what you think of them, what you liked, what you didn't like. It helps me out, and it makes it so the content gets better for you, the viewer. So anyway, though, uh, have a wonderful day, everybody. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a great day, and bye. What else can I say other than thank you very much for everything. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye, everybody. Wrong button. <laughs> okay. Have a wonderful day. Thank you very much, for everybody. Uh, bye. Oh. Might want to run now. Apparently there's a witch that doesn't want for this all to end. Actually, a little surprised. I didn't think that there'd be witches in this. Apparently she wants to join my uh, area here. But she's not invited, so there. Not dying anyway. Am I? 
Okay, well, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you like these videos, please feel free to uh, like them and to subscribe. It uh, lets me know that I'm doing good. Uh, feel free to make comments in the comment section saying that you don't like the videos. That way I know what I can improve and what I can uh, change upon. Thank you very much, everyone, for watching. Have a wonderful day. Uh, catch you all later.